the worst advice from a recruiter. Just put put one of your resumes and a little flyer and a card, put it all in, in everybody's mailboxes. That's the best thing that you can do. Um, but don't you think that that's kind of a waste of paper and ink um, instead of focusing in more on the area of expertise that my resume is showing? Well, I didn't even see your, re your, your expertise on your resume. I think that's a little bit graphic for the audience that you're trying to go for. <laughs> I, I mean, I, I'm a bartender. I, I mean, that's it. I, well, I wouldn't I, tell anybody. <laughs> well, if nobody knows, how am I going to get hired? Like I said, put your resume in everybody's mailbox, and then somebody is going to go. Well, look at this. I wonder, I wonder what this person does. And then some day somebody's going to give you a call and they'll ask you, well, what do you do? And they'll be ready for you. Doesn't that make sense? You know, I, I'm really glad that I paid you a hundred dollars for your advice. Um, I, I, you're, you certainly have a, a, a unique way of looking at things. It, it's well, more, like yeah, it's kind of like television. You just kind of, or radio, you're just kind of blanketing it out there, but you're not narrowing it down. But I do it's see the numbers point. game. Yeah. It's yeah. a numbers game. Yeah. I see you that. Know, you just, you, you, you just go, you just go. And, the, and, but, but it, it increases your odds. Some yeah. people, some people like to focus in on certain little things, but to me, that just limits your scope. Don't so you think I'm going to we'll put a lot of money out for no reason? That's all. <laughs> well, our time is up, so we'll have to do another session. Okay, I'll, I'll, I'll write you a check. <laughs>